Imagine having a helpful phone agent that takes your order quickly and accurately every time. This video will show you how to build your own phone agent using Filio for phone numbers and wapi.ai to create a powerful voice assistant. Check out the links in the description if you would like to get the system prompt that was used in this video. First, get a 10 digit long code from Twilio. You can create a free trial account by going to twilio.com and get the virtual phone number. As you can see, Twilio gave me $13.35 as the trial balance for my trial account. Then let us go to wapi.ai to set up the AI customer support voice bot. Currently, all new accounts get $10 free credit in WAPI that you can use in voice workflow. You can see we have the starter credits here and we see $10 has been granted in free credits to test voice workflows. First, let us start creating a new assistant. Let us click on this dashboard. We will be taken to our dashboard where we can start working with the assistant. We can click on this create new assistant. We can create the assistant from a blank template or select an existing template from here. Here I am selecting the blank template and then click on the continue button. Let us name our voice bot as Midas King Fast Food. Then click on the create Midas King Fast Food button here. We need three things to finish the basic setup of our voice bot. First is model, then transcriber, then the voice setup. First, let us set up the model. Here, first message is what the agent is going to say when answering the call. Here, I will say, Welcome to Midas King Fast Food. How can I help you today? Then, we will provide the system prompt that has all necessary details on how to handle the customer phone call. Let me copy paste the system prompt. Here, I have my system prompt. Here, we can specify more settings for the provider. Currently, I have open AI, but you can select different large language models here. We have Grog, Anthropic, and for the model, also we have different options that we can choose from. Currently, I have selected GPT 3.5 Turbo Cluster. You can also choose GPT 4 Turbo Cluster as well. And temperature, I leave it at 0.7, and max tokens, we'll leave it at 250, the default values. Keep in mind here, WAPI is showing us the cost. The various components that contribute towards the cost and the various components here that contribute to the latency. Latency is how quickly we get answers from the voice bot. Depending on the parameters here, depending on the configuration that you choose here, your cost will vary. The latency also will vary. With the current parameters that we have selected, our cost is 1 cent per minute and latency is 950 milliseconds. Now click on this transcriber button. You can specify the provider, the model and the language here. The provider we are using now is the DeepGram and the model that we will be using is Nova2 and the language is English. We will not change any of these values. We will just leave them as they are. Then let us click on this voice button. Here you can select the voice that will be used to answer the customer call. We have several options to choose from the provider. Currently I am using 11 Labs. We can use PlayHT, DeepGram, OpenAI, any of this. And within the provider, we have options to select the voice that we like to use. Here I am using the Sarah. If you click on this, we have various options here that we can use. Once you are finished configuring the assistant, you can click on this publish button. There are a couple of more functions that are advanced. We will cover them in subsequent videos, the functions and the advanced settings. I'll go ahead and publish this. Now our voice bot is published. Now we can use this web mode to test our voice bot. Once our voice bot is published, we can test it. We can test the web version by clicking on this talk with Midas King fast food button. I will click on this now. Welcome to Midas King fast food. How can I help you today? I want to order some food. Great. I'd be happy to help you with that. What would you like to order today? I want to order cheeseburger. French fries. I like regular fries. All right. I have your order as a cheeseburger and regular fries. Your order will be ready for pickup in approximately 10 minutes. Thank you for choosing Midas King and have a fantastic day. Let me end the call. Seems to be working fine. Our main intention is to set up a phone agent to take 
phone orders. For that, let us integrate the Twilio account to Wapi account. Click on the phone numbers here. You can see two options here. The one is buy number, meaning you can directly buy phone number from Wapi. The other option is import, meaning you can import a phone number from outside. Click on the import here. You can see we can import a phone number from Twilio or from OneEdge. We're going to import our phone number from our Twilio account. Go to your Twilio account to get the values for these fields, the phone number, the account seed, and then the auth token. Let me go to my Twilio account. Go to your console and there you can see the details of your phone number and the other parameters that you need for WAPI. Here we have a copy button that we can use to copy the values. I copied my phone number and pasting my phone number here. Copy account seed, paste it here. Copy auth token, paste it here. Give it a label. Let me call this Midas King and then click this import from Twilio. Once you successfully import the phone, you can use it as inbound or outbound. Inbound is to receive incoming calls and the outbound is to make outgoing calls. Here we are going to use the inbound as we are setting up phone agent to take phone orders from the customer. In order for the inbound to work with the voice bot, we need to select the voice bot that we have created earlier. Let me click on this drop down. This is our agent we have created. So now we have attached our voice bot to the inbound phone number. Once the configuration is done here, we can start making calls to that inbound number and the phone agent will handle our call and take the food order. Let us test our voice bot now. I'm going to call the voice bot from my phone number. I'm casting my phone number onto the screen so that you can see the dialing portion. Welcome to Midas King Fast Food. How can I help you today? I want to order some food. Great. I'd be happy to help you with that. Would you like to hear about our menu options or do you already know what you'd like to order? I know what I want to order. Fantastic. Please go ahead and let me know your order and I'll make sure to get it right for you. I want to order cheeseburger, french fries, and bottle of water. Got it. One cheeseburger, an order of french fries, and a bottle of water. We'll have your order ready for pickup. Thank you for choosing Midas King and have a fantastic day. Thank you. Bye. Goodbye and enjoy your meal. Congratulations. You built a voice bot to take phone orders from customers. Bye. Until next video.